Unwelcome guests. Unwelcome guests, Brian Polly. Madam Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, it was a beautiful summer day. My family and I were in the backyard digging for gold. My daughter says, Dad, look, a chipmunk. I look around, I don't see a chipmunk. And then I look at the patio door, which is locked. And from inside, looking out, there's a chipmunk. <laughs> Immediately race around the house and cut through the garage and run into the basement. No chipmunk, even though I'd beaten the record previously set by Usain Bolt. <laughs> now panic stricken, I randomly look around the house and I run into the washroom. Lo and behold, the chipmunk is in the washroom. A little bit relieved that I found it, I grab a towel. As I grab the towel, I go to throw it on the chipmunk. As I release the towel and it floats gently to the ground, the chipmunk darts and hides in a little corner. I pick up the towel and there's a note. I pick up the note and it says, you're out of acorns in the backyard. <laughs> <laughs> Irritated to no end, I rip it up and I throw it to the side. I know this is false. I restocked the backyard with hate cards yesterday. <laughs> I run out to the garage and I grab a baseball bat that I got that Babe Ruth had handed down to me. <laughs> I run into the washroom and the chipmunk is back in the open. Uh -huh. I tiptoe like as if I'm going along landmines. And bam! One swing, chipmunk is done. He's out. Thrilled with my success, I thought, I can't believe it, I got it in the first try. And then, lo and behold, I look up on the screen of the window. There's another chipmunk. Fortunately, I speak chipmunk. He said, you big old, what have you done to my brother? And by the way, I had dinner with your wife last night. <laughs> <laughs> Irritated to no end. I look at the bat, think twice. I decide not to swing the bat at the window. I go back to the towel. I pick up the towel. I step towards the screened window and I throw it. The chipmunk lunges over the towel and lands on my shoulder. My head says, smother the chipmunk, smother the chipmunk. <laughs> my body says, run for the hill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm freaking out. The chipmunk runs down my chest, down my leg. He disappears out of the room. I grab Babe Ruth's bat and I take off after him. My heart is pulsating. My adrenaline's going. I find the chipmunk in the bathroom and bam, one swing, I get him. The mess is a lot bigger this time. The adrenaline got the best of me. I go back to the washroom to get some cleaning supplies now, and lo and behold, another chipmunk. Disgusted, I grab the bat, and I start chasing it. Swing and a miss, swing and a miss. This chipmunk is like ninja chipmunk. I can't even get close to it. I noticed some racing stripes on its back, but that's all I could see, and it would disappear in the back. Realizing I wasn't going to get a good swing in the open, I got out a folding chair and I climbed up on top of it. I'm going to go over the water heater and step on to the water softener and I'm going to get the chipmunk that way. I'm going to jab him. I get on top of the water softener and the lid comes flying off and I come crashing down and I gouge my leg into the treadmill in the room. The chipmunk had sabotaged the top of the water softener. <laughs> I race upstairs. I meet my wife coming into the house. She wants to get a status on the chipmunk. And she sees the blood on my leg. She goes, did the chipmunk attack you? Like, no, I did this to myself. She realizes immediately I'm not interested in dialogue and she exits and goes back outside. I bend my wounds. I come back downstairs and lo and behold, the chipmunk is now sitting on the folding chair that I had set up to climb over the water heater and water softener. And then I look, this chipmunk isn't a normal chipmunk. His eyes are a little different. And then it dawns on me, he's bionic. <laughs> I run outside into the garage. I whip together a electromagnet, just like the one I gave MacGyver for Christmas. <laughs> I go back downstairs. Chipmunk is still sitting in the chair. I flip the switch. The chair comes folding, crashing on the chipmunk and up to the electromagnet. I flip the switch off and they both fall to the floor. Pretty proud of my success. All chipmunks accounted for, I clean up my mess. After I clean up my mess, I go outside. And my wife said, did you get the chipmunk? I said, yeah, I actually 
got all three. Three! Three chipmunks? I'm like, yes. Well, if there was three, couldn't there be four? Like, oh no, there's only only three. How can you be so confident? I saw the movie. Elvin, Simon, and... <laughs> <laughs>